Chili day, Oh, Nap. only one word, burr. <laughs> yeah, burr. I don't know if even chili does it, right? It is right. downright cold, not frigid. You know, that was last week with those yes. mid-20s Monday morning. But yeah, cold enough to even produce a little bit of sleet. Now, the light rain changed over to a little bit of sleet around mid-morning. The question is, why? Meteorologist Marina Newman is here with not only video of the sleet, but an explanation on what happened. Marina? Hey, Bill. Well, we saw that video of the sleet that came down. First video shows in Leon Springs, and you can see where it's coming down at HDB. Once it makes contact with the parking lot, though, it begins to melt, so there's no impact to the roadway. But check this out. We have a great little explainer for those types of winter precipitation. And what we saw today, that was sleet. So it starts out as snow, but then it passes through that layer of warm air, causes it to melt, but it refreezes once it gets through that warm air layer and gets back into cold air. Now, unlike freezing rain, it melted once it hit the concrete. But the difference between sleet and freezing rain is that freezing rain, instead of passing through that warm layer and then refreezing, it freezes by making contact with the surface. That's what causes those slick roads that we'll sometimes have to deal with in these wintry conditions. But, well, it might be chilly. Doesn't look like there's any chance for wintry conditions on the way, Bill Taylor. No, that's it for that, right? And um, we're grateful. Yeah, freezing rain is so much worse because it's ice on contact. Thanks, Marina.